Hey guys, iPod Touch Helping here, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys an easy way to save your SH, SH blobs or files. And basically, this allows you to save your files so that you can easily downgrade to a certain firmware when you accidentally upgrade. So when you upgrade, sometimes you can lose a jailbreak and stuff like that. But um, basically, saving these SH, SH blobs will always give you that option to go back to a firmware. You don't have to be jailbroken to do this, but you can be as well. So what you guys are going to want to do is go to iFaith. And you guys are going to, or sorry, go to ihatesnow.com and download iFaith just by clicking that download link right there. And then once you have downloaded it, you should get two new files. Here they are right here. So what you guys are going to want to do is extract the first one right here and you will get this new exe file. You guys are going to double click on that and then it'll open up just like this and you guys are going to want to click OK. We're going to have a couple different options here. We're going to want to click dump shsh blobs and then we will click proceed. Um, before we, before you click proceed, make sure your iDevice is on one of those firmwares that was listed and you have one of those devices. And then what we're going to do is click let's go. Do I have an Apple TV? I'm going to of course click no because I'm using this iPod Touch 4th generation here. So what you guys are going to want to do now is turn off your iPod or iPhone by holding the power button. As you guys know, make sure it's fully turned off. And once you have done that, click start and we're going to do something here. Five seconds, we're going to hold the power and home button. So I'm going to start doing that right now. So I'm holding both the power and home button right now and I'm going to be doing this for about 10 seconds. So there we go, it just went back down. Now I released the power button right there and now I'm just holding the home button and I'm going to be doing this for 30 seconds. All right. So once you guys have completed this, you should be able to be in something called DFU mode. And there we go, as you guys just saw, I'm now in DFU mode and I can release the home button. And we have um, the S we have uh, iFaith doing its thing here and getting our SHSH blobs for us. The cool thing about this uh, certain SHSH blob uh, thing is it actually saves your SHSH blobs both on their website and also on your computer. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to save it on your computer after it finishes up here. Now this can take a few minutes depending on um, depending on your iDevice and such. And as you guys can tell, I have a little bit of writing right here, and we're just going to let it do its thing. So now, as you guys can see, we've got this pop up here on our computer. And what you're going to want to do is simply save this to somewhere that you will remember. It, and um, I'm going to just simply save it to my desktop, click desktop, and then click save, and boom, my SHSH blobs have been saved onto my computer right there. So iFaith has finished saving your SHSH blobs. Okay, thank you. And basically, guys, that's how you do it. Thanks for watching. This was iPod Touch Helping. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And now your iPod or iPhone or iPad or Apple TV should turn back on just like so. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys did like this video. I had a lot of requests on to do this. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.